The state of Minnesota is a big payer of senior services in Minnesota, <clears throat> and they've been that way for years. So the demographics change and the number of people getting older, it's putting a lot of financial stress on the state and taxpayers. The difficulty is that our, our funding is consecutively, has been consecutively cut, and our expenses continue to expand. I know that it's one of the first places that they cut. I can't understand why. Um, it's it's devastating. We can't continue to meet the needs of regulations and increased rules or licensing requirements without expanded revenue to do what is asked of us. We as administrators um, ask you to make seniors number one priority. We need the funding. We need to be able to pay the caregivers the kind of wages they need. We don't get a raise unless there's a cost of living increase, which I think is absolutely ridiculous when someone works incredibly hard at making someone's quality of life better. We all know that in 2030 we will have such a large number of people to care for, but right now it's 2012 and we have not made any significant efforts in finding a way to care for these people. You're going to be here one day. Do you want the best care possible? Please don't cut senior care funding for the main reason is we need to provide care to those who have come before us.